Okay, I'm here with Newton Dog signing Nathan Adua. Uh, Nathan, gym's fully packed here, ready for day training. Welcome to welcome to Oriel Park. You were training on Monday with the with the squad. What have you What have you made of the lads so far? Um, well, thank you very much. Um, the lads are a great bunch of lads. They've helped me settle in straight away from from the first day I've landed. Um, training's also been a very high intensity. Um, I would expect that from the champions of Ireland. But um, no, it's been good. It's been good. I'm just, I'm just raring to go, and I want to start playing regularly again. You know, I've been out for quite a while, but um, no, it's been good. First couple of days I've been here, so yeah. Yeah. When, when did you first get word of the dog's interest? Um, I actually got it around January time, but um, I was training with another club at the time. Um, so I don't think I could have come down at the time, but um, after that I spoke to Liam um, again, and then um, he just said, "Look, come down, have a look at it, see what you think." And I was actually surprised with the standard and the facilities, you know, because yeah. in England they don't really talk about the Irish league too yeah. much, but um, here, as you can see, they've got a great gym facility, change rooms are um, good, even the canteen's very good, so. After seeing all of this, this, this standard is actually a European standard, you know, so yeah. I thought I have to stay. I'm sure the, the attraction of European football in the summer was a, was another sort of you know, big card for you. Oh yeah, of course. Who doesn't want to play European mm. football, you know? It's probably the biggest competition in the world. Um, so yeah, that was a big plus. Yeah, you've obviously tasted football in the continent. You've been to Slovenia, Denmark, I think you're in Israel. It was your, your last stint. Well, you've had an interesting career to say the least. Obviously, you came through the ranks of Tottenham. I'm sure that was a, a great education for you. Yeah, um, I've been I've been around many places mm. for for only 24 years of age. I mean. Uh, I have travelled quite well. I've also experienced European football when I was in Slovenia, um, playing Champions League qualifiers, European League qualifiers, like I'll hopefully do here. Um, but yeah, it's been good. I've had a lot of experience. Um, I've learned a lot whilst being abroad, living alone, and that's only helped me um, become the player I am today. So, yeah. Yeah. I'm sure most people here be looking looking up on your your, your career. Your loan spell at Rangers was probably the most notable one. That the rainbow flick that that we all seen, and that was your debut, I think, was it? Yeah, that was my <laughs> debut against Hallowell, You know, um, I remember the gaffer just saying, "Go on, be free, express yourself," <laughs> and I was like, "All right." Um, I think it was five nil up at the time, so. I just thought, okay, let me just show them what I can do, you know? Like, I like to express myself, I like to have fun. As you've, as loads of people would have probably seen in the videos, um, whilst I was on loan at Rangers, which was probably my most notable spell, um, where I really took off in the market. But, but um, yeah, yeah, from them videos, you'll get a little taste of what I'm about. Yeah. Are you at the stage now where you need, you need some security, you need to sort of, you know, Establish yourself fully at a club. Yeah, one hundred percent. As as you know, in the footballing world, it's it's pretty cutthroat, and mm. um, security is what players like to look for. You know, constant playing time as well, and somewhere where they're happy to to play and express themselves. So, one hundred percent, one hundred percent. This is the time. Mm. How far away are you from? It's been a long time since you played a match, but how far away before we can expect to see you in a white jersey? Um, hopefully not too far. You know, as a player, I'd I'd love to play every game, um, but obviously I need to still earn the right to play in this team. You know, it's a very good team, and um, I will work hard to make sure I get in the starting eleven. Um, but like I said, I'll speak with the physios and the sports scientists and we'll take it from there, to yeah. be honest. Listen, the very best of luck to you. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thanks, Nate.